Park Review, where I review parks. Hello everyone, and today you're in Park Review, where I review parks. And we're at Parc en Ciel, also known as Park in the Sky for the English people out there. I'm going to review this park like no park has been reviewed before. It's going to be incredible. A good park needs a good place to eat. So first, let's review the table. Well, as you can see from this, there's a little bit of an angle here. I don't like this. I don't like this at all. It makes me not trust the sturdiness of this bench. So if you look, there's no graffiti in it. Oh, there is graffiti in it. What is this? Pierre Antoine Yannick Bencher 2021. It's recent, so maybe they clean it. There's a Yannick here. No dicks, from what I can tell. There's no dick. So that's pretty good. Is there any gum? That's the question. There is a gum. See it? Look, look at this gum. Look at it. It's there. Being a park reviewer includes doing dirty stuff. So let's clean this park. It's too... Ah, I have dirt! <laughs> this is the danger of being a park reviewer. Look at this. Look at this. I'm injured in the job. And you can even see a goldfish. And there is even a little fly eating something suspect. Is this a gum? Is this sugar? Is this gum? I don't know. I don't know. Let's try to eat. We might not be able to do it. It's too disgusting. <laughs> Now that my meal is done, I've been attacked by a fly. This is not a good sign. Now that my meal is done, I will wrap things up and go review the trash can. Which, if you didn't know, the trash can is a really important part of a park experience. Do you know why a trash can is the most important part of a park experience? Park? Park? You know what I mean. If there's not a good trash can, well, there's going to be trash everywhere. But if there's a good trash can, there won't be trash everywhere. So here is the trash can. As you might see, it seems clean on the surface until you look at the gum. So let's try it out. Seems smooth. Seems smooth. The hole is not big enough for my thing, which is annoying. You need to press a lot. But it seems... What is happening? Right. It did the job, it did the job. You look at it, no big damage. Overall, the trash can gets my approval. It's a good trash can, does its job. It was made by Equipark. So you guys, you get a thumbs up from me. That, that's a good trash can, that's a good trash can. Now it's time to review the ground. As you can see, there's some stuff on the ground but you can accept this kind of stuff because it comes from trees and trees go in park which makes sense so there doesn't seem to be any trash that doesn't belong here little rocks i can allow little rocks but if you look at the grass this doesn't look appealing this is not good grass this is bad grass you might say oh it's because of the season well look there that grass is greener so the fact that there's some yellow grass makes me kind of angry i don't like this now let's go look at a tree so there's some branch, you can expect branches. The tree has some green stuff on it. I don't enjoy the green stuff, I prefer a brown tree. When there's a brown tree, you're like, oh yes, you want to touch it. I don't want to touch this. I will touch this because I'm a professional park reviewer, but don't do this at home. The texture of the tree is good. If you could feel this, you would understand. My end doesn't have a lot of debris. This is a tree in good health. This is a good tree. I like that tree finally. I don't like the color, but the tree itself is pretty good. Now that I'm done with the park itself, I will leave you with the ride professional. You might say she loves to ride. It's Mary. Thank you, Alain, for this wonderful introduction. I do actually like to ride. So, as we can see, the park itself is pretty good, but does the rides hold up to the reputation? So, we can see here that uh, that's a pretty big uh, area, and also, it's not the only one, like, there are so many rides, like, there, and there, and there! I can't believe it, it's the first time in my life that I saw uh, all of this ride. And there's also a little uh, shit here, but we don't talk about this. So, is this in good quality and sturdy? <laughs> yes, it is. Because we don't want a child to break his neck, you know. Ooh, 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 no! <laughs> I, wouldn't, <laughs> I wouldn't trust this. So, <clears throat> you know, 
here we can we can see that there was a, a little child uh, musical instrument and it also count as a little prison for little uh, bad boys and girls who want to do uh, like you know uh, mis mischief in this park you can go behind bar and do little musicas there's a uh, but there's no graffiti that's good because sometimes there's like writings all over the wall this i'm not sure what it is it could be anything <laughs> Mm, but this pole is pretty hot uh, and I'm sure it will hold the well. Here we can see someone sold little uh, <laughs> little woods and it's pretty sturdy look ooh, ooh. you can fall you can fall on this and not hurt yourself. <laughs> okay well we shall go in the ride. Sorry to interrupt this beautiful video, but I need to tell you about our sponsor. Totally Normal Journey. This game that was totally not made by me is available on a PlayStation 4 for only $5.49. And it is the best first-person shooter you have ever played. And it doesn't even include any first-person shooting in it. That's how good it is. So please, go buy it now on the PlayStation 4. It's the best game you will have ever played. And if you don't own a PS4, it's no problem. Just go buy a PS4. I don't care. It's okay. You can go buy a PS4, I don't mind, or a PS5, it's compatible. So, thank you. Now, back to your beautiful entertainment. Those, ter those stairs are pretty boring, but I, I still enjoy it. This, uh, it makes me feel like the king of the world. That's good. Now, I can see here that there's multiple slides. I think I will get the big one because you know I like it big. But f first, maybe the small one then. So I'm in position. So this is the little slide. Let's see. It was pretty fun. Okay, now so it's time for the big slide. I'm a little dangerous girl, so I will take the dangerous route. <laughs> Holy shit. Well, uh, yeah. <laughs> okay. This is uh, very hard and with one end, because you know, uh, I'm not uh, 12 anymore. <laughs> Holy shit. Okay. Um, I'm scared to die. <laughs> okay, I'm good. I did it. Now it's time for the big slide. I will have a lot of fun. Ooh, yo! <laughs> Holy damn! That was intense. Uh, I saw my life flashing before my eyes. There's jump. So, you know, if you don't like jumps, don't go there. But it was very fun. I give points to that. I will leave my place to my wonderful acolyte Alain so we can do the final review. So now for the final review, I must say I don't like this. There's some water. This is kind of dirty. I let's role play one second. Let's role play for the end. I'm a kid. I'm playing. <laughs> I do this. I fall. No. Sploosh. Now I'm all dirty and people think I peed my pants and I'm like, oh no, no, I didn't pee my pants. And they don't believe me. I get bullied. My life is ruined. I never find a job because people call me pee pants. My life is fucked. All of this because of that water. So guys at parc en -Ciel, you need to fix this because that's not good. That's not good. I must say again, good tree. So overall, after the review of Marie for the rides, I think... It's pretty good. I've never seen a park that had this good of a shape, this good of trees, everything. It's kind of falling a little bit less uh, less positive, let's say. But overall, I like it. I like it. Would I go again? Would I eat Happy Meals here again? Yes. Yes, I would. So overall, there's no translation for the park name officially. That's kind of iffy for the bilingual side of Canada, but I will let it slide. We're in Quebec after all. People are dumb, they don't understand English, that's alright. So, 
8 out of 10. It's 8 out of 10 for me. It's a big park. I, I approve it. Come from the USA, come from Brazil, come here and eat Happy Meals. It's, it's pretty good. So I will see you in the next park review. God bless parks. Yeah, it was a totally normal journey. All they did was go to Mars and they fought monsters.